Let's take a look at how to vote using Twitter. Simply download the PowerPoint Twitter tools, as we covered in an earlier video, and go down to the slide to do with voting, and put it in presentation mode. And it works in a very similar way to the feedback slide. You need uh, to choose a search text that you're going to give to people, and they're going to use that to vote via Twitter. So in this case, it's simply vote example. And I've already made a few votes, and you can see it comes up uh, very quickly. Let's test it and actually try and send out a tweet now and see if it gets recorded. So I'll move over to Twitter. And there's two different ways you can compose the tweet. You can either just say um, a number, so three, and then the search code. Or if you don't want to annoy all of the people who are following you, you can put at vote by tweet in front. And what that does is, by default, anybody who is following will not get to see this message and they won't get confused. So we are simply going to tweet that out. Off it goes. And let's switch back to the PowerPoint slides. And see how long it takes to come in. Now, typically it's somewhere between uh, 30 seconds and a minute. It's variable because of the, the amount of traffic on Twitter. Uh, by default, the slide refreshes every 30 seconds, um, but you can hit refresh if you like. And there you can see it came in extremely quickly. There's a variety of different formats. You can have it as um, you know, up to six different choices uh, or as a pie chart. And it's as easy as that.